Close your eyes and, as always, come back to the breath. Focus on the breath all the way in, all the way out. Try to make it comfortable. These are the principles we follow all the time. It's because the Dharma is something that stays the same all the time. The world changes. The economy goes up, the economy goes down. Diseases come, diseases go. Seasons change. Civilizations rise and fall. But the Dharma is always the same. It gives us a sense of security, knowing that the solutions to the problems, whatever the individual forms they may take, the basic solutions are always the same. If you're looking for suffering, you want to see the cause of suffering, well, it's inside your mind, even though things outside may change in horrible ways. Still, the causes that make the mind suffer come from the mind itself. So we always look inside. If you want protection, then you want to make sure that you don't harm anybody else. If you want to be happy, there are the basic principles of merit. You're generous, you're virtuous, and you meditate. These are things we can always fall back on. It's not the case that we have to find a new script for every new play that comes along. Our basic role is to see how we can get out of the play so we don't have to suffer and that we're not causing anybody else any suffering either. And the script for that role is always the same. Look inside, look inside. Straighten out the things inside, and the world outside will come and go. But as long as the mind is well trained inside, you've got the sources for happiness right here. That's something you can always rely on. So even though the instructions are always the same and it make it a little bit boring, the fact that they're always the same can give us a sense of security. We can always come back here. The mind strays away from here, well, you know that it's gotten far away from its own true interest. So we keep coming back, coming back, looking into our own minds, training our own minds. And that's where the solution for all the problems will be found. All the problems in the world that weigh down the mind, weigh it down because of the suffering. And where does suffering come from? Things we do. We're not skillful in how we deal with the issues of the world. If you learn the basic skills inside, because the mind's lack of skill starts from its own lack of skill with itself. It doesn't know itself. It hasn't trained itself. Once you know yourself and train yourself, then you know the basic principles for making sure that there are no problems in the world that will weigh down the mind. So look inside. And always remember the Buddhist teachings. This is why we take him as a refuge. We take the Dharma as a refuge, the Sangha as a refuge, because they're always the same. They're always a safe place to go.